Hello everyone, and welcome back to Shadowrun Dragonfall. We are still on the Mark VI mission, where we were stymied last time. And I think we should be okay to do a successful run this time. Mostly because I have to remember that Glory here has the Adrenal Injection ability. And the thing is, when I get cyberware in these games, because I do like getting cyberware, especially on my main character here, um, I forget that there are active abilities. Because I, I only really do the cyberware for the, uh, for the passive boost, right? I, I literally forget that it's a thing. So with that, we should hopefully be able to hold on to um, her trauma kit for if we really need it as like an emergency backup. Just use the um, adrenal ability when we can. Now, I do also have to remember to be a little bit more conservative, and I don't need to engage this group. Uh, they don't need to be fought. Instead, we slip past through here and down over here. Now, they might still like come running once things are getting desperate over there, because I noticed this group ran to support over here. Either way, third time it should be the charm I just uh, had a little bit enough with last episode I kind of had to let it be I'm gonna have you chill well you know attack from farther away so that you're not seen just so we can get an extra turn of getting close to the rigging expert before he starts walking on to the cyber zombie. Nice, alright, I can work with that. Big cluster over here, so. How's about. Ugh, I'm not close enough. Um, let's keep it to gunplay for the moment. Where is the rigging expert? And yes, that is what I'm going to insist on referring to them as. For reasons I mentioned last episode. Nice. Good shots, good shots. Do a little blasting too. Bit of a miss. Well, we missed anyways. Bit of a misclick, but that's okay. We've got a good arm. Probably a high throwing skill. Shouldn't use up all my grenades right now. Alright, and I feel a little bit more secure about getting you closer up. He hasn't even spotted you yet. Break my armor, bro. I need that. Okay, Deatric, can we definitely get some healing going on over there? And we'll get an accuracy up on me. Nice. And then I'm hoping Mr. Cyber Zombie here. Kill these two with collateral hits. Nope. Unfortunate. Glory. Yeah, don't don't waste your specials yet. Let's maybe see if we can't get some kills this way. No, but we did damage him a fair bit. Maybe I will throw a grenade this time, just to 
finish him off with over time. Looks like we have. Just killed these two outright. That's pretty awesome. And... Ah, rip. I was hoping that would be a hit. Is he doing his hacking? I didn't see the lock-on message. And that just prevented me from healing that 17. Alright, we're gonna have to take a health kit then. Nope, okay, now he's starting. It's not nothing, but it's not great. Just missed everybody there. Come on, Glory. What are you doing, girl? Killing that guy. That's good. You just have a couple of fetishes. Which, that word always makes me feel like I'm 12. It's legitimate usage. Question it. Let's see if we can't get a hill a uh, kit. A hit I can speak English on the rigging expert, but I could not. Take out the mage. Beautiful. You know what? Just go ham. Maybe we'll do a point blank. That usually gets a kill. Might not need to. Get a haste on. Too bad I can't haste the cyber zombie. And then maybe just pop him in the face. Beautiful. Gonna have to reload this right here. Now? Yeah. Point blank him. Not enough for a kill. Did draw aggro though, so that's huge. Alright, everybody, go ahead and just push. Cyber Zombie will get us to kill. Reload your weapon if you need to. Well, you still have a haste, too. That's good. Uh, sure. Go ahead and light him on fire more. Let's see if there's... Uh, I mean, healing one doesn't really seem worth... Maybe have Iger use a uh, first aid kit on herself. Trying to be a little bit extra cautious. I really don't want to have to do this one a fourth time, you know what I mean? Beautiful. I think I'm going to try and ignore this area entirely. Everybody just get into position. Dietrich. Sure. It's something. And at the very least, if everybody else else goes down except us, we're okay. But if we go down, it's game over. Which, you know, tracks. Oh, Glory could use a heal. Did that use two? Rip. Okay, we can go in and get ready.
Glory really doesn't want that heal, although he does have a cooldown, so that's fine. Everybody get into position! We're gonna kick that door down and go charging in, so I really want everyone in position. Good, Dietrich. We'll be able to do the heal next turn, which is not the greatest, but it's something. Alright, Dietrich, go ahead and do your support. some point-blank death. Let's see, Knight Errant Captain, the Mage, or the Enforcer. We'll take out the Captain. I mean, you know, it's the best we can. Finish that. Not quite. Very unfortunate. Oh, we need me over there. Although, it's really just for the, um, for the cameras, which we don't exactly need at the moment, especially since we've already got them once. Very good. Ow! Behind full cover. Okay, that is a fair enough. And Glory is stunned. That's not great. Why did I choose to move him there? That's fine. We should still have time to get Glory over there and heal. Can I please go to the corner? Hello, the tile's right there. Fine. I'll box them in. That kill the mage? Good. Please not another flashbang. That's fine, I'll take a small bit of damage. Okay, glory. Go get me. Dietrich, give haste to Iger, who can hopefully do some good heavy lifting here. Nice. We'll draw a little bit of aggro. Hey, uh, I will take a health kit, though, if you could. Thank you. Dietrich, why don't you heal a wound? Get Iger's nine. Glory has more health anyway. Hi. Try out a shotgun for a moment. Nice. Go stand in front of her. And then you just go melee him to death, I think. Very nice. Okay, you'll do that next turn. Everybody else just maybe go kind of chill in position. I'll be okay over here by myself. And if we get you ready to flood out over the corner here, we should be okay. Just have to be careful not to be spotted. 
you guys can just sit and wait as long as possible. How's that sound? We know they'll see us if we go there, so let's just stick to right about here-ish. That should be okay. Now, Dietrich can summon some spirits over there to cause some damage. So I might summon one over here and then just let it loose. But we'll see how that goes. Last four rounds. Okay, we'll get ready to cast a bunch of those in a bit. Loaded. HP 20. Ah, uh, save it. And then you can just chill. Everybody can chill. You gotta remember that more enemies will show up as we advance. Can't even hit anyone. Uh, maybe do an Overwatch then. Nice. Just a regular attack, not the assassinate, unfortunately. And the Lost Summon Shield, who can go up over there. And start blast him. Unfortunate. Well, at least we got a hit with the uh, regular one. Shield bot might go down here. Nice. said take it out. Come on. What are you doing? Okay, it'll die next turn. Nice. Maybe you can die this turn. Nicer. And what did that two turn charge give you? You do nothing. You can you do any healing? Yes. And maybe start getting these accuracy buffs up. Everyone else can just chill. All your guns are loaded. Yep. meant to be a uh, killer, but it was not. Here, you know what? Go ahead and come and draw some aggro. I'm okay with that. You'll probably die. I'm also okay with that. Oh, rip shield bot. And rip assassin bot. Very unfortunate. Come on, stop missing that one, bro. What are you doing? What kind of chicanery is this? Wait, why are you charging again? Did you lose your buff? 
down. Okay, seriously, I kind of need you to die. Please die. Gonna haste up on Iger again. Then this should hopefully be the last turn before you can charge. It. Before you okay, and then four orbs will show up as well. So three orbs, two orbs. That's better than both of my estimates, and I still miss. Very annoying. That's fine, at least they're having similar luck. Nice, didn't get hit once. And that is the end of hostilities. We have the cameras, let's get the heck out of here. I think it's gonna take us one more turn, unfortunately. Yeah. All right, that's fine. Um, I kinda wanna get in here. We have an accuracy buff, we have a haste buff, let's get an accuracy buff as well. Do they have to stay within range? I think they do. Get you into position. I shouldn't be clustered. I literally put her in the only medium cover spot. That was that was very good, Shadow. I'm very proud of you. All right, time to do some sniping. Where is the rigging expert? There you are. We'll have you wait just a moment and then we'll have you come charging out. out of here. Jack out. And go try and meet up with your crew. Okay, where is the rigging expert? Right there. You think so, do ya? I do not. We've got some good accuracy on a bunch of people here, so let's spread out some damage. Very little of it. God damn, Glory, what are you doing? Probably should have had him heal himself now that I think about it. Nice! Okay, we don't have to worry about that. That's unfortunate. Right, we should get uh, someone to do it over here to spread some chaos. When he's able. Ow. Okay, we're here to join the fun. You 
well while we can. Let's get a headshot on the mage. Nice. Didn't kill like I was hoping, but that's fine. Lob and all your. Oh, okay, well, that's Deatrick down. That's me almost down. Are you fucking kidding me? Alright. Do that one on me. We'll get Deatrick up next turn. Finish him off. Screw it, finish him off. Or at least try. Draw all the aggro you can, Cyber Zombie. Don't you dare take Lori down. She is our absolute lifeline here. Heal. And. do very little. And then I'm tempted to keep this for me, but Dietrich really is a valuable member of the crew too. Yeah, that's fine, Zob Cyber Zombie. You can take a bit of damage. Good, they're falling back and regrouping. Let's fall back with them. Now let's see if that one group we skipped will come join. Because if it does, that means we're going to have enemies coming from both sides, which is very not good. Nope! They're chilling. Works for me. Skip a fight. Let's go. Um, okay, everybody's up. Heal if you gotta. Let's try and get into some good bits of cover. Wounded 25. Hey, Deatrick, you maybe want to... Oh, no, you can't. Glory, why don't you stay back here for a moment? join them. They're not going to be tossing any grenades, and you can take advantage of that. Get that captain out of here. If you can. Which it looks like you couldn't. Oh, you definitely need to summon. It's not going to be quite the chaos I wanted, but that's fine. Fourth that dude. Oh, you have to get close for it too. And be right out in the open. That's wonderful. We like that. My throw isn't that good. If I want to use these, I'll have to get a heck of a lot closer. Okay, let's try and get that grenadier out. Good showcase. Got good cover? Go for it. And reload.
come down here and harass their sniper. I don't want him getting any good pot shots off. Like that. How do you have aim that good, my guy? I hate you so freaking much. I hate this map so freaking much. Please go rogue. Nope. Wow, that hurt. <sighs> I am so mad right now. I can't even explain. I hope you go rogue. He did not go rogue. That's fine, that means I get to control him. But I do hope he goes rogue, because then he'll just be a big menace over here, and I can have Dietrich do things. I gotta remember there's that one mage up there who actually took me out in the first place. Glory goes down, but we're screwed. And Dietrich is down. I can't believe we're gonna have to fourth try this map. I am so mad. more turn. Okay, so we have to survive this turn as glory to be able to get just me up. So Dietrich is absolutely going down. Please take this guy out. Please take this guy out. Thank you. something. Don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare! Oh my god. I do not want to retry this one again. You're gonna have to. We need you up. Good, that's another one down. Go harass these guys, make them feel unsafe. I think it's just them three left. What are you doing? Stop it! I am so frothing mad. I hate you guys so freaking much. Oh my god, he's hard to hit. Alright, you know what? Fine then. Reload. Uh, 
94% chance and we still missed. If there is any more fighting in the basement, there goes Deatrick. We are absolutely screwed, like unequivocally. Why am I pushing? Why am I pushing? Okay, please come over here and murder this guy. Not quite. Sniper. Beautiful. Tag team. Damage on the mage. God damn! Iger do a push. She's wounded, but hopefully we can get some good shotgunning. Yeah, yeah, focus on the cyber zombie. I swear to God, every single attack that goes against me has me clench up a little bit. in there and mess him up. Thank God. Okay. Get the hell out of here. We are leaving! Please let this mission be over. Please let this mission be over! Not that I don't relish the challenge. I'm just... This level has thoroughly kicked me in the face. Oh, please don't let there be more go. Just our choice. Just our choice. Just a choice. Okay, just a choice. Poor Dietrich. Oh, taking over. Yep. Oh, <sighs> okay. You step into the garage, prototype in tow. Before you are two vehicles that you know would be waiting: your client's van and the lodges. I suppose that it's time to make a decision. We have two clients, and they both want this thing. But then, thing isn't the right word. There's a living troll buried under all of this chrome. Handing him over to either of them would be reprehensible. The decision is yours, Shadow. Make it a good one. It really is. Um, but uh, ultimately, it doesn't matter too much. If we go with the lodge, we get extra money. Uh, we get chewed out a little bit, and then whatever. No consequences come of it. Uh, Herr Schmidt is displeased with us, uh, but still pays us what we are owed, so it's the money option. Like, we get, like, the most money from going with, uh, like, the Lodge. If we go with Schmidt, we're still gonna get whatever bonus reward we get from the Lodge, because we've done their two other requests. Um, or we've done one, and I will absolutely do the other one. Um, so no consequences there, we just won't make as much money. If we do the third option, talking to the cyber zombie and having Glory do her thing, um, nobody gets the prototype, although technically Schmidt will. Um, he'll be pissed with us, but he'll still pay us what he owes us. No consequences either way. So, client or Lodge is going to give us the most money. Pissed off client, pissed off crew. No consequences, though. Uh, client will give us the base money. Uh, group's kind of pissed, but they're like, fine. Uh, Lodge is like, yo, it's not cool, but well, we still like you. If we go with this one. Both of them are kind of pissed. We'll still get paid by them, though. Group's happy. I'm going to keep the group happy. We're not hurting for money. As you approach the Mark VI, its head turns to track you. Its body is held at rigid attention. God, that's eerie. It's almost like it's waiting for something. Have Glory disable the Mark VI's control circuits. All right, I'll see what I can do. Glory takes a moment to examine the protrusion at the base of the Mark VI's spine. Then she pops the case on the Cyber Zombie's control unit. Her sculpted fingers flicker and dance in the Mark VI's circuitry. A 
moment later, a strange shiver runs through its body. It stumbles forward, lurching awkwardly on its feet. A few seconds later, it seems to recover. It stares at its hands for a moment, then turns to face you. The Mark VI speaks two words. Its voice is as brittle as broken glass. Thank you! Slowly, mechanically, the cyber zombie reaches up to grip its head in both hands, and it squeezes. Caught in the vice-like grip of those heavy industrial cyber arms, the Mark VI's cyber skull might as well be made of tinfoil. The air fills with the tortured sound of tearing plastic and buckling steel. The Mark VI gives a final heave, and its armored skull crumples like a paper cup. Its body goes slack, and it topples to the ground. Dead. Glory looks into your eyes, and you can see a flicker of warmth. That was the right choice, Shadow. He clearly wanted to die. Come on, fearless leader. Let's load the body into the van. She glances down at the Mark VI's ruined body. Herr Schmidt won't be happy, but he'll just have to live with that. Yep. Finally, we are done this cursed mission. We were so battered and bruised. I clearly need to upgrade my combat capabilities, too. I'm not a liability, but almost... The U-Bahn feels especially cramped on your ride back to the crew as bosser. In your mind's eye, you can still see the carnage that you left behind at the AG Kemi building. Memories replay themselves, over and over in your head. Fleeting visions of a hulking thing made of muscle and chrome. You put them aside. Shelve them for later. The job is over. It's time to collect your pay. Okay. Now to wait a year for the cruise boss to load. Your PDA rings and the face of your fixer, Paul Amsel, appears on screen. I have uncovered some... oh. I have uncovered some terrible information. The team is assembled in the safe house. Please, please meet with us there when you are able. Okay, uh... I guess story has progressed because we have earned money. Anything new with Sam? Probably not. Yeah, no. Anything new with you? No. Nobody leveled up from that mission, which I find a little unbelievable, considering how freaking intense it was, but that's fine. Let's post all of our Shockwell and Rider data. Karma gain 2,000 credits. How much money do I have at the moment? 2677. Definitely need to spend some cash on some weapons. We could do Drogon Kip 2, which is uh, Blitz's mission. Oh, and I want to go let him know about the deal we made. I forgot to do that last time. Altuk. What's up, Luca Deer? How you doing? My organization is displeased with your performance in the AG Kemi Europa office. It would have been very easy for you to make some extra new yen by doing what we asked of you. Yeah, that's fine. I'm still gonna get your reward. You only have to complete two out of three. Altug. I sent a man named Quarren to talk to you. I told him he could have access to your data taps. You did, did you? A bit presumptuous of you, is it not? Gorn and his gang have been hijacking shipments bound for the cruise boss, so we made an arrangement. He listens to your taps, they leave our goods alone, and steal from our enemies instead. I see. Well, that sounds like a tidy little arrangement you've made then, FNDM. It's been so long since I've done all Tube's voice, I've completely forgotten, so we're going with this. The kind of arrangement I might make myself, he laughs. The kind of arrangement Monica would have made. I will honor your promise then. Quarren and his gang shall have access to my data taps, save for those that listen in on the cruise bosser itself. Uh, ah, not that such taps exist, mind you. No, of course not. 
Recently procured a bottle of 50-year-old uh, Islay Scotch. Would you perhaps be interested in acquiring it from me? Islay, you say? Might I examine the merchandise? Takes the bottle and his smile fades for a moment as he becomes all business, examining it with a critical eye. Then, as quickly as it faded, the huge smile is back. Quite a little treasure you have found. I am sorely tempted to ask from where, in hopes of procuring more, you see. But no, it would not be polite. I would perhaps value this bottle at 400 new yen? 500, since I've got the only supply in town. Ah, thank you, my friend. I have a buyer already in mind for this little gem. Or perhaps I shall keep it myself. It is good to always have something special on hand for a celebration. Cheap booze. Uh, no, not quite. I received cases of this for less discerning clientele. I could offer you maybe 10 new yen? Now hold on to it. Might be uh, useful somewhere down the line. With you new from Kami. Oh yeah, new stuff with her, because uh, I think it's been a while since we visited. Kami purses for lips. Not a lot I can tell you that you haven't already guessed. Resident spy master, coffee brewer, outsider, the official Turk of the cruise bosser. That's not news to me. Yeah, I doubted it. She winks exaggeratedly. You're too smart for me. But you want to know why, right? It works for him. He had to make some sort of living here in the cruise bosser, you know? He's not got a trade skill. He's not goblinized, so he couldn't hang with Beckenbauer. If he opened a normal shop, he'd be ousted by someone thinking he's stealing their job because he's not German. And the coffee shop was a good option because it's obvious. He stays exotic and does what they expect of him with the intel and stuff. She pulls absentmindedly at some hair in her face. Sorry about the intel dump. It's not really useful information. And you'd probably guessed anyway at this point. But you asked, so... I've been a doll. Anything else? Hey there, have you been? Things are alright. Good, I hope they stay that way. Let me know if they don't, though, alright? I'm always up to help. For now, gotta help out two more, though. See you later. Anything else? Nope, things are alright. Okay. I haven't even gone back to the magic shop. There's bound to be lots of dialogue with them. We'll do that another time, though. I don't really want to deal with them this episode. Um, I'll get more money if I go back, because uh, the pay data that we posted for sale is probably done. I don't really want to get caught in a big, like, thing, though, so if I can just slip by them and slip out, we'll do that. I'd like to get Blitz's job done before we go any further. I don't like having side quests hanging over my head, you know what I mean? Hey, guys. Not having a meeting right now. Sorry. One unread message, one last DVD. Screen flickers to life and Melit's face appears. She wears a plastic smile. Hi again, Shadow. Well, I've recovered one last DVD for you, but I'm afraid that's all you're gonna get. You might as well use the rest as coasters. They're all beyond repair. If you look on the table beside your DVD player, you'll find the disc that I salvaged. She pauses, a slight frown crosses her face. To be completely honest, that was a lie. To recover this last disc, I was forced to subcontract. Shroddy is still a brute of a man. I am unimpressed with his manner, and his poor hygiene disgusts me. But he's very good with old things such as this. All credit where it's due. Alright, we'll check that out next time, too. Claim payment for the Mark VI. To call your work unsatisfactory would be an understatement. When I said that we wanted the prototype, it should have gone without saying that we wanted it intact and operational. We technically fulfill the terms of our arrangement, so you will get paid. But don't ever expect to work for us again. Yeah, we wouldn't have ever had a new job with you anyways, so not a big deal. Any pending? No. Uh, Shadowlands. Post pay data for sale. I had no pay data for sale, okay. So we've all seen this one floating around the tricks. This is some serious stuff. It's got Heavy Duty Corp written all over it. Not a lot of players could be behind something like this. Ares or SK or maybe one of the big Pharma Corps? Say Sharing or AGC? Of course, you can never totally discount the Azids either. Tolstoy, my esteemed colleague, this is indeed a recipe for some top shelf dreck. 
Whispers from the shadows say this is sourced straight from the F state. Hello boys, I'm a big fan. You know, long time reader, first time poster. Quite an interesting concoction you have there. I'm just itching to cook some up. So many interesting properties to play with. I've already go I've already got a few tweaks in mind for my own special version 2.0. <laughs> you sure that you want to do that? That stuff this stuff doesn't play nice, and corps are really bad at sharing their toys. You can, of course. Always share their secrets for them. Just gotta make sure that you run a little faster than them. Always running, eh, clockwork? Like clockwork. Bandit, I'm touched by your concern, but don't you worry about little old me. I do declare the shell be ever such fun. I don't know if I've ever actually uh, taken that money before. Just because, like, Formula 17 isn't something you necessarily want out in the market. So I don't know if I've ever read that exchange before. Please help me find my daughter. She ran away from home. She's human in her early 20s with short blonde hair and data jack. She was last seen wearing a light blue dress. Worried mother. This is not exactly the place to be looking for missing kids. How did you even get in here? I paid good money to get on here. I was told you people could help. If you've got the new yen, you came to the right place. I sent you a number that you can reach me at. The old help me find my missing kid routine. The classic. My money is on escaped wage slave. Make sure you do your homework, Ruby. Lol. Anyone have a good backup plan for when you get stuck with a tracer? Barely managed to bug out of my apartment after a corp hit squad came knocking. Lesson learned, pat yourself down a couple of times and make sure you don't have a tail. But if I miss something, I'd rather keep my safe houses, you know, safe. I've had good luck with RF blockers. I have a jamming grid set up near my safe house. It projects, it protect, no, it projects my signals to a few miles away where I've got some cameras placed. So when someone shows up there, I know they were trying to find me. Then I do a thorough sweep to find the tracker. Sharp. How long does that go on before they give up? Re Tolstoy. Usually rule of threes. I keep reprojecting the signal to different locations. In my experience, they give up after the third one is a dead end and stop listening to that RF signal. I like the whole Shadowlands thing. I don't. It wasn't a thing in Returns, and I don't think it's a thing in uh, Hong Kong. But I, I like it. It's a, it's a neat little insight into the world, you know. All right. I. Th I think that's all we can do. How's our Alice fun? <laughs> we are 80% uh, of the way there. It's kind of funny. I also think I've got a fair bit of cash right now. Oh boy. Alright, maybe I'll go do a little bit of shopping. And then, um... Guns. We definitely want some guns. So let's go see uh, Dude Face, who's over here, I believe. Gunari. I knew it was a G name, but it definitely was not Gunther. Cash and need weapons. Okay, first off, we're gonna sell that Mossberg. Only three twenty-five. Rip. And we are selling our rifle because we are absolutely upgrading. As for stash, got a bunch of med kits. That's nice. What am I currently wearing? It's got better armor, I believe. Probably want to upgrade that soon too. Got a lot of health kits. That's good. Don't have to buy any more. Okay, rifle, 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 rifle. Oh, here, you know what? Before we do some buying, let's use that karma to upgrade our stats a little bit. So quickness is at five, ranged combat is at four, rifle is at four. Let's do ranged combat five, quickness six, and four more points to spend we could save them that might be nicer too for a bit longer range of grenades we will have our intelligence not bad Charisma is at 7. 8 is the next one. Let's just save for now. We've upgraded our range combat, which is good. 
Let's see here. Whee! Alright, our last rifle was damage of 11. So we're up to damage of 13, which is pretty huge. And those are snipers. We need range combat 6 for that sucker. Heckler and Kosh? Yeah. If we take the smart link, it's got uh, better accuracy, I believe. 32L13. Yeah, okay. So we'll take that. Can we upgrade our sniper? No, I think that's literally what we're rocking. Uh, yeah, we would need range combat 18. Or, uh, range combat 18. Range combat 6. Okay, that's fine. Outfits. It's more armor. Oh, that's what I'm wearing. Yeah, I'm wearing armor 6. Okay. Definitely good to sell that other one then. So let's first buy that. And then I want to take a look at his consumables. Grenades and such. So I've got one flashbang, one phosphorus, and one high explosive. These aren't too expensive. Let's maybe buy a few more just to have as backups. better the knight errant or the cavalier oh the knight errant because it makes targets easier to hit which is the unbalanced effect what about phosphorus got any of those negative i think those are probably technically illegal Take off the extra grenades. We do want to carry a couple of health kits. What do you your flashbang? Ah, that's the top of the line. Okay, so we'll drop one Knight Errant and one Cavalier. Actually, we'll just drop all the new ones we bought. And then let's take some med kits. So that's good for him. Let's head on over to the um, Ezkabel. I want to get some... Maybe that one intelligence boosting thing. I think we have enough for it. Cyberware. <sighs> 5,000. Oh, yeah, I totally have enough. Oh, but I'm already rocking a head thing. Oh, no, I already bought it. Oh. Oh. I knew that. I totally knew that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I totally knew that. Okay. Anything else I want then? Got an eye data jack. Anything for our body? Plus one movement. When triggered, you will dodge the first attack against you each round. Last three rounds. That's pretty damn good. Bioware coats and lubricates joint surfaces of legs to provide extreme fluidity of motion, plus one dodge, plus one quickness. That's pretty decent. I actually don't think I want to mess with any of these right now. Out of any of them, maybe that one. But that's also all the rest of our money. Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe we'll wait to cyber ourselves out more. Anything else I want to buy then? Not really. We'll hold on to our money for the moment. Kind of feels nice. Alright, then I think the next thing to do is going to be taking care of Blitz's mission. Oh, we'll watch the DVD. We'll watch the DVD and then we'll call it done. Actually, you know what? No, I'm starting to change my mind so quickly. Uh, that kind of feels like it's going to be... It's it's related to the main plot, which it is, of course. But just as Ansel's meeting is, I think I'd like to combine those two for a big plot dump. So let's get ready to go hit up Drogon Kip. Either way, I think we've been going for long enough. So this is where we are going to leave things off for today. Thank you to everyone for joining me. I hope you had fun. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. For a moment I thought Dietrich was gone, I was about to have a panic attack. And I will see you all next time for some more Shadowrun Dragonfall. Bye bye